Uh, I started pole vaulting when I was 15 years old. I started jumping at my local club where I was already doing other athletics events and uh, I approached my first coach, Mark Stewart, who was nice enough to coach me and he actually coached me all the way up until uh, my first Commonwealth Games, which was in Melbourne in 2006. Um, I'm from Melbourne, Australia. Uh, after the Melbourne Commonwealth Games, I moved to Perth and that's where I now live. Yeah, I've been here for nearly two weeks. I'm enjoying my time in the village. It's a fantastic village. It's so convenient having everything located closely. All the volunteers here are very helpful and I've, I've had a fantastic time. Sure. Yeah, I think the sporting facilities here are excellent and I think uh, they're going to be a good legacy from the Commonwealth Games for the local people of Delhi to enjoy and use and make the most of. Well, all I've seen of Delhi is what I've seen on the bus on the way to the stadium and from the village, but after I compete I'm planning on going out and seeing a little bit of Delhi. I'm very much looking forward to it. I've always wanted to come to India, it's a place that's always fascinated me and I'm looking forward to getting out and having a look. Uh, I think that um, most people that become a champion in their sport have two common elements and I think those things are commitment and passion. If you're not passionate about what you do, if you're not committed, then you can't be successful, I don't think. Uh, I just finished my last training session. Uh, I'm competing tomorrow night in the main stadium. I think my major competition is going to be the person that I actually did my last training session with, Steve Lewis, who's the English competitor. He's also my training partner, so it'll be a nice competition between the two of us and hopefully I win. Yeah, we're good friends off the field, and we're good friend, friends on the field, field as well, but hopefully I win. Uh, can you give us a nice uh, shout or something? Aussie. Aussie. <laughs> I don't know what we do. What, what, what can I say in Indian? Yeah. <laughs>